Ton has a question. I think we're not going to be able to get you on screen there, Ton. Ton has a question. Ton says, I've built an Apex 5 and I cannot get the camera to center. So check this out. This is a, a common problem that a lot of people are not aware of. So here is Ton's build. And the picture that you're seeing here, Ton has moved this camera all the way to the side using washers. So you're looking at this and you're going, it's off center. It's off center because he's trying to fix the fact that it's off center. Here is the actual image that Ton is seeing in their camera. And do you see that we've got the left standoff here and the right standoff? The camera needs to be moved to the right, but it's already as far right as it can go. So the issue here is that the, the sensor inside your camera is sometimes not centered up or not correctly aligned relative to the lens. And so even when you center your camera, the image that you see may not be centered on your frame. And this isn't always true, but in a case like this, Tan, uh, there, there isn't anything you can do to fix this uh, except switch the camera and cross your fingers. Um, it may be that your camera is not quite square, possibly. But the reason I think this is interesting is that People go to a lot of trouble to set the up tilt of their camera to be how they want it to be. But I have seen cases where a person had three builds, three of the same camera, and the visible up tilt was not the same between them because inside the camera, the sensor was slightly misaligned between the three of them. So if they set the camera to exactly 37 degrees of up tilt, what they actually saw inside the goggles was not consistent. And I think it's, uh, I think of that whenever people, they're like, how many degrees of up tilt do you fly? 22.5. I use a protractor every time I set it to exactly 22.5 degrees. It's like, well, you know what? If you're doing that based on your lens or based on the body of your camera, you may not be getting the actual consistent up tilt that you're looking for. And at the end of the day, I probably should just base it on how the quad flies and how it feels when you fly it. Um, I don't have an answer for there, for you there. But I don't think there is a great answer. If the T-Rex camera is off center consistently, like maybe you could find a way to push it forward so you don't see the, you don't want to see those, uh, up, those standoffs. And then the fact that it's off by a few millimeters probably won't affect you at all while you're flying. Yeah, move the camera forward. That's what I would do. And then it won't matter. 